Hey everyone, this is Starla here and I have a fall decor video for you guys. So I'm going to show you all my fall items in their places. So I usually don't do that. I just tell you everything that I buy, but you guys never get to see it in my home actually being utilized. So let's get into it. So these are just some of the fall items that I'm going to use to decorate the house. Um, so I'm really excited to show you guys this and where they're going to be. So, and who do we have here? A kitten! <laughs> so yeah, let's get started. Are you ready, Kayan? Mm -hmm. Alright, let's do this. Okay, so first stop is the TV entertainment area. And it just looks so boring. There's no seasonal decor there. And so we are going to spice this bad boy up with a couple of things. Let's go. Okay, so for here at our little TV stand in the living room, it's pretty simple. Um, I have my Dollar Tree vase there with a, I guess, fallish plant. <laughs> um, and then some Dollar Tree rocks. And then that's another candle like I got from the Target collection. That's the LED light. And we just put the leaves there from the Dollar Tree, the straw from the Dollar Tree, and then those are my Dollar Tree pumpkins. I have one there and on the other side of the connect is another pumpkin so simple minimalistic um fall decor but very affordable and i love that yes okay so in the kitchen i just want to add a little bit of fall and thanksgiving give that festive vibe and so i found a little area in the kitchen that i think i want to revamp so let's look at this so we're going to simply take this paper towel put it over there move my ball jars and put the family cookbook frame here boom i think that looks a lot better all right so for the dining room i didn't add much um to the dining room table i kind of actually like it really clean and spotless so and they didn't have enough grateful placemats but i do have this big grateful um jar that i got from a friend's event all right, so here's our mantle. It's very, very, very sad and not fall ready. So we are gonna get it fall ready. So this is our fall mantle. Um, pretty much the same things, but um, a little new treats here. And that's our fall wreath. So this is DIY. So the clothes pins are from the Target Dollar Spot. And these leaves are from the Dollar Tree as well as the straw banner there and then we have the same thing here this was DIY so the candles they actually sell some candles like these at the Dollar Tree but I bought these at Target um, a while back a three pack um, but yeah I just put the leaves from the Dollar Tree on here wrapped that straw around in a cute little bow and as you can see I ball jarred that up <laughs> to make it a little candlestick and I have little rocks from the Dollar Tree this is my happy place sign that's from Target Dollar Spot and these little pumpkins here that you'll see throughout the video are from the Dollar Tree. And a friend, she actually ah! took my mirror. Oh, you can see the bit. <laughs> she took my mirror and she um, etched um, my husband and I Mommy. on anniversary date on there. So that's really cool. And then you can see the Target Dollar Spot thankful and grateful um, plate there. My friend and I went half on that, so it was a dollar fifty. And then um, I have the little um, the etch the easel. Oh, I can't speak. And then I have the easel hanging it up there for the Dollar Tree. And then some more of the candles that I DIY'd. So that's our mantle, looking very fallish. Hi. And that's Kayan. <laughs> And then that is the Ghostbuster pack. My husband's making proton pack for my son's Halloween costume. So our TV area in the basement is not fall ready. It is looking really sad. So I'm gonna give it a little fall Halloween um, update and I will show you guys that shortly. So above our TV in the basement, I made it more of a Halloween theme. So let's go into detail there, okay? So this little pumpkin here is from the Dollar Tree. Um, we didn't want to do real pumpkins this year, so we just got the styrofoam ones, and <laughs> they're good enough 
I didn't know it was going to show a lot of the white. I thought it would be orange, but I thought about spray painting it, but I was like, you know what? It's not that big of a deal. Um, but there's a Dollar Tree strobe light in there. Um, this one, it, the battery's missing, but you'll see it in the next one. And then we have this printable that I made in my shop or on the website. If you'll check it out, starlokmathis.com um, for the freebies link. And then I have another Dollar Tree pumpkin there with our Roku and then a picture of my baby girl. And here is a candle. Where is this candle from? Hmm. Oh, Costco. I got a three pack. And so, yeah, so I still have this candle here. Just kind of DIY'd it. I thought it needed like a little stem for the leaf. So I put the Dollar Tree, or not Dollar Tree, the Target Dollar Spot clothespin there. And then you have the straw wrap. And then my handsome guy. And <laughs> random, this is actually our doorbell. So it's kind of cool. Um, so when you hit the doorbell, it'll play a song and it lights up and glows. So that's really neat. And then we have our little zombie girl. I keep calling her a zombie girl. Our mummy girl. You have our little mummy girl here from the Dollar Tree. And then another printable that you can find on my shop, Shake Your Boo Thing, that I made. And here is the pumpkin that is strobing. So it looks really good in the dark. So I'm going to turn the lights off so you guys can see it. So there you can kind of see it strobing and you can just kind of see the scary Halloween mantle underneath the TV. So it's kind of, I wish the other pumpkin light was on so you can get a full effect. But yeah, so this pumpkin was just a dollar for the pumpkin. Uh, we bought the carved kit. No, actually we used our own carved kit from last year. And then the strobe light was a dollar and the batteries from the Dollar Tree. So three dollar pumpkin right there. Boom. And the eyes are actually hearts and a little mouth. So. Yeah, I think it's really cute. So our door is a very, very, very sad door. <laughs> There's no decor here. And so we are going to change that up with $2 using Dollar Tree products. Let's go. So now the door is decorated and we have our cute little happy harvest sign. Do you guys like this side better? Or do you like it with just the brown side? Let me know in the comments below which one you guys prefer best, okay? Can you say bye bye? Love bye. Bye guys, thanks for watching. Check out us on StarlaKMathis.com. My best time. Yes, dot com. Mm -hmm. And Instagram? Big thanks. At StarlaKMathis. Yes. Bye, love you. Can you say love you? Love you. Oh, you're so sweet. You're so sweet. Bye guys.